Greetings, business-minded, efficient, organized Virgo. My name is Eliane Nicole. I'm an astrologer and tarot card reader, and now I'm going to get into the October 2019 forecast for Virgo. And I'm just gonna do the tarot cards right now. But if you would like to know what's going on with the planets, definitely contact me to have a transit reading done. And um, in the meantime, you can watch the videos here for your sun, moon, and rising. And if you don't know your sun, moon, and rising, that's definitely something that I can um, tell you if we do a birth chart reading. Uh, my contact information is in the bio. And I love doing readings, so I would love to read for you. Now I'm going to flip over these cards, and then I will show them to you and explain them to you in greater detail. And... For the month of October, you have two major arcana, Virgo. You have uh, the Wheel of Fortune, which is about fate and destiny and the cycles of life. And you have death, which is about change and transformation. So, and it's also about rebirth. So, um, as we enter the month of, uh, of October, Virgo, uh, you're the Six of Cups reverse. This is maybe not seeing eye to eye with an old friend or with someone who you love. Um, uh, it could be a child, it could be an old friend, and you are covered by the Queen of Swords reversed, which is... Um, a sharp-tongued woman. Um, it can also be a woman who's withholding information or not speaking. What could come into being is the Five of Cups reversed. This is a, um, a disappointment. Uh, this is what crosses you. It's not what could come into being. It's, it's what crosses you. And this is the Five of Cups and it's a disappointment. Um, and that's looking like it's a you know around mid the second week or the end of the second week of the month and the basis is the three of swords reverse this looks like somebody is getting over um heartache and pain um perhaps caused by loss or separation of some kind what's leaving is the Knight of Swords reverse. So this is a man um, being conflicted in the month of September. It looks like that's passing. What could come into being is the Nine of Pentacles reversed. And that is about a, uh, this could be feeling insecure, um, feeling scarcity or lacking of some kind. What will come into being um, is the Wheel of Fortune reversed. This is um, maybe feeling stuck, like things aren't moving forward around mid-month. It could be uh, like um, an unexpected twist of events uh, for the worse around mid-month. Um, fears or insecurities are the Knight of Rods. Uh, this is a man who is on the move, possibly a fire sign man like a Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius, but it could just be a man who is energetic, active, on the move, in action, but looks like there's a fear and security around him. Others see you. Death. So it looks like there's a big change. Others see you making a huge change this month. And death comes up for all different kinds of things for people when I read. Um, sometimes it's the death of a job, the death of a living situation, the death of um, a relationship, the, you know, moving locations from one city to the next. I mean, death is just any big change in life. And the positive feelings are the Ace of Swords reverse. So it looks like you may have positive feelings about holding back an idea, a new idea at this time not sharing it and then the outcome is the ace of cups which looks like at the end of the month it's a rebirth it's the birth of new love new hope um peace um and that is the uh forecast for virgo for the month of october 
Uh, thank you for joining me, Virgo. If you like this video, give me a like. If you didn't <laughs> like it, give me a don't like, but I hope you liked it. Please subscribe to the channel if you have not already. Please share this with your other Virgo friends and follow me on Instagram at astrology.tarot.elianenicole. And thank you for joining me, Virgo. Have a great October.